Hello boys and girls, welcome to grade 5. This is Nofal Gattan and today we will start with our new book 5A. Let's start with Unit 1, Episode 1, Our Heritage, Our Pride. Today we will learn about new vocabularies and reading comprehension. So, let's start with our new vocabularies. Please take a look at the pictures and follow us. We have a new word which is heritage. Heritage. Heritage is a noun. Please repeat after me. Take a look at the photo. Heritage. Again, heritage. Perfect. There are some places which are known for Kuwait's rich heritage like Al Mubarakiyah Market. This is how we use the word heritage in a sentence. Again, there are some places which are known for Kuwait's rich heritage like Al Mubarakiyah Market. Great! Now let's move to the next word. Study. 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 Take a look at the picture. Study is a verb. Study. I usually study in the afternoon. This is an example. Can you think of other examples, please? I usually study in the afternoon. Very good. Carry. Carry. Again, carry, which is a verb. Take a look at the picture and see what is the boy carrying. Excellent! The boy can carry all these books to the classroom. Again, the boy can carry all these books to the classroom. Now, think of other examples. Next one. Touristic. Touristic. Touristic, it's an adjective. It describes a place. Touristic. Very good. There are many touristic places in Kuwait. You can visit some of them. Excellent. Very good, boys and girls. Say it one more time. Touristic. And remember, touristic is an adjective. Now, think of other examples to use touristic in a sentence. Electricity. Electricity. Electricity is a noun. It means power. Now, electricity lights our houses and operates our machines. Electricity. Now, try to use electricity in new sentences of your own. Very good. Excellent. Paraffin lamp. Paraffin lamp is a noun. Take a look at the picture. And let's see the example. In the past, people didn't have electricity. They used paraffin lamps. Excellent, boys and girls. Center. Center. Take a look at the picture. Again, center is a noun. Take a look at the, at the blue circle and see the small dot. There is a black dot in the center of the circle. Center. Excellent. Now try to use it in a new sentence, please. Let's move on. Factory. Factory. Factory again is a noun. What is factory? Take a look at the picture. Very good. We visited a chocolate factory last Sunday. We visited a chocolate factory last Sunday. Now, let's practice together. Choose the correct answer from A, B, C or D. Number one. This bag is heavy. I can't it. A. Carry. B. Light. C. Study. D. Respect. Try to remember the new vocabularies and you will know your answer. Of course, yes. This bag is heavy. I can't carry it. All right, question number two. We visited KDD last week. A. Lamp. B. 
center. C, electricity. D, factory. Yes, you're right. We visited KDD factory last week. Excellent, boys and girls. All right, boys and girls, now let's move on to the next part, which is the reading comprehension. Remember, there are tips for reading and try to read them very well. Number one, read the text more than once. Tip number two, read the questions first. Tip number three, read the first sentence of each paragraph. And tip number four, write your answers in full sentences and clear handwriting. Good luck! Now, let's read the text together. Dixon House was built in 1870. The Dixon family lived there for many years. There are 30 rooms in the house. 150 years ago, people didn't have electricity, but they had paraffin lamps to light the houses. Al Mubarakiya Market is one of the oldest touristic markets in Kuwait. It was the center of buying and selling in old Kuwait. People bought everything from there. The Sadu House is an artistic place in Kuwait, mainly built to save the heritage of Sadu weaving. People in old Kuwait didn't have cloth factories. They wove Sadu to make clothes, bags, carpets and mats. Now. That's the paragraph. Let's answer the questions together. Now, try to choose the correct answer from A, B, C and D. All right. Number one. The best title of the text is A. Modern Kuwait B. Schools in Kuwait C. Kuwait Touristic Guide D. Shops in Kuwait Yes, that's the correct answer. Kuwait Touristic Guide, the best title of this text. Now, question number two. The opposite of the underlined word old in line two is what? A. New B. Happy C. Sad D. Slow Try to read the paragraph above and find the opposite of the word old. I'll read it for you. Al Mubarakiya Market is one of the oldest touristic markets in Kuwait. It was the center of buying and selling in old Kuwait. People bought everything from there. So what's the opposite of old? Of course you would know it. It's new. All right. Now, answer the following questions, please. When was Dixon House built? When was Dixon House built? You can find the answer in the paragraph, of course. Dixon House was built in 1870. Yes, you are correct. Dixon House was built in 1870. Question number two. Why was Al Mubarakiya Market very important? Why was Al Mubarakiya market very important? Go back to the paragraph and you would know the answer. All right. Al Mubarakiya market is one of the oldest touristic markets in Kuwait. It was the center of buying and selling in old Kuwait. Yes, that's the answer. It was the center of buying and selling in old Kuwait. So that's why. Al Mubarakiya market is very important. All right. Now, there is a homework in our pupils book page 22. Please follow in the instructions and read the clues then identify the places. Don't forget your homeworks. All right. You've got to read the clues again and then you have to identify the places as number one is answered already. You can shop and buy many things there. Al Mubarakiya Market. Now please answer the rest of the questions. So we have reached the end of this episode and we've learned lots of fun things together boys and girls. We learned how to use new vocabulary in meaningful sentences and reading to answer comprehension questions. Thank you for watching us and hope to see you soon. Thank you boys and girls. Mm -hmm.